And in fact, there's another named storm on the way, Elizabeth, my goodness. Yeah, there certainly is, Jane. Yes, I'll start with today, though. Another very cold, quiet day of weather. In fact, I bet these sheep here in Oxfordshire were pretty glad of the woolly jumpers this morning. It was minus eight degrees Celsius. But changes on the way. We're swapping the cold, wintry weather for something an awful lot milder through the weekend. But it will be wet and very windy with storm Isha heading its way towards us on Sunday morning, Sunday night into Monday morning. Now, the whole of the UK is covered by a Met Office yellow weather warning for the strength of the winds. But some areas of most concern, marked in amber here, they've been upgraded. And we could be looking at widely gusts of 50 to 60 miles an hour. Some spots seeing 70 to 80 mile an hour gusts, particularly towards exposed coasts. Of course, this is all going to have plenty of impacts on your Monday morning travel. So do keep an eye on the forecast. Hello, it's certainly been another cold one for us, but we had plenty of sunshine and blue skies around and that will continue through this afternoon. Now, we do have a Met Office yellow weather warning in place for Sunday for wind as Storm Isha is announced with a change in our weather. We have more of an Atlantic influence bringing some milder temperatures. We have some tighter isobars potentially bringing some windy conditions and also some weather fronts moving in as well. So by Tuesday, temperatures could pick up to around 15 Celsius, quite a contrast to what we've seen already. We have rain in the forecast and we have some windy conditions to come as well. Hello, good evening. Temperatures once again falling away out there, but tonight the last of the cold nights because change is in store for this weekend. Now, those winds are increasing ahead of that weather front for Saturday nights. We do see some outbreaks of rain. You may well see some early rain on Sunday. That clears through fairly smartly, but it's into Sunday we see the arrival of Storm Isha. So those winds really whip up through the day. There's potential for gales into the afternoon and particularly, I think, overnight for Monday morning as well with the risk of some damage and disruption. Do take care. Sarah, I hear there's another storm coming in this weekend. The yes. What number? Nine? Nine, yeah, that's right. We're up to I in the alphabet. So Storm Isha has been named. It's going to bring us some really disruptive weather, uh, particularly later on Sunday and into Monday as well. So, yes, be warned, it's on its way. Not quite yet. We've still got some relatively quiet weather out there for many of us and cold too. This was the picture as the sun went down a little bit earlier on in Pateley Bridge, North Yorkshire. So some beautiful colours, fairly calm and serene for now. But as we head through the weekend, well, things are turning milder, but also much windier, particularly by Sunday into Monday as we see the arrival of Storm Isha. I do know it's, it's very cold out there. <laughs> it is, isn't it? It's cold, but there's been some sunshine. Not too much of that, I'm afraid, over the next few days. This was the view, the skyline of London looking beautiful out there today, but it certainly has felt chilly. But as we head through the weekend, it's all changed because we've got the next named storm on the way, Storm Isha. Hello there, good evening. It's all change weather-wise as we head through this weekend. It's been cold and wintry through the week with snow showers in the north, sharp overnight frosts and Lots of dry weather, some weak winter sunshine too on Friday for many, but much milder feeling conditions. Over the weekend, it's also going to be wet and very windy with a named storm, Storm Isha, on Sunday night into Monday morning could cause some disruption from strong winds. I hear that the big freeze is almost over, but there's a storm on the way. That's right. Do you know what's really good is the fact that, bearing in mind it's Friday and it's January, there's nothing happening with the weather. It's so quiet. I mean, you can just <laughs> put your feet up. Nothing. Storms. You're right, it's storms. So we've covered the snow, we've covered the ice, we've covered the everything. And we're going to have a massive step change with the weather over the next 24 to 48 or hours, just as a way of being able to just really describe this. Last Tuesday, Tuesday just gone in Birmingham. It was just two degrees as our maximum daytime temperature. Roll forward a few days from now and we're going to be seeing highs of 14. So well below, then well above the seasonal average in really just a week. So incredibly warm weather really coming up, but also that brings with it incredibly unsettled weather as well. If we have a look at what's going on, you can see with this uh, temperature contour, it's cold over us at the moment, but as high pressure starts to move away, it opens the door to the Atlantic. There is Storm Isha, which is going to be scooting in Sunday night into Monday, bringing very disruptive conditions. And then another very deep area of low pressure, which potentially could be named as we move into Tuesday and then Wednesday. So we've swapped the very cold stuff for the very unsettled stuff. So definitely it is worth keeping up to date with things at the moment because it's a very rapidly changing situation. But unsurprisingly, with Storm Isha on the cards, we have weather warnings coming out of our ears. Sunday into Monday, as I say, I think the bulk of it is going to be moving through Sunday night. 
We have amber weather warnings in force for very strong winds gusting up to 80 miles an hour in places. But for everyone, it is going to be very, very windy indeed with some very heavy rain. So, as I say, there's no rest for the wicked, which must mean that we have all been very naughty indeed. Lots going on this weekend. Let's have a little look. As you can see, we've got Storm Isha on the cards, as I say, which is Sunday, increasing winds on Sunday and then into Monday as well. I think the bulk of it is going to be moving through Sunday night, but it is going to be very windy indeed, very wet as well, potentially disruptive for the rush hour on Monday morning. Exactly what we like. So, honestly, this is changing all the time. It's definitely worth staying up to date with the latest weather warnings. Another potential storm on Tuesday, which would be Storm Jocelyn. OK. <laughs> Thanks very much.